So my girlfriend thought that Donatella and the turtles couldn't get up on the turtle dog. I told her, no, they can do it. Watch. So I'll throw them a little food. Oh my And there they go. <laughs> go right up for it. So if she can do that, then that means she can go up there. Bravo, Donatella. We just put them in here. We just made a, a switch over to this tank and um, set up a little bit differently than the one downstairs. Let's zoom back here. It's got the uh, two turtle dogs stacked on top of each other in the corner without this piece of cork underneath it to give it support and to make it easier for them to climb from one to the other. Now the reason why is because I have a, a four foot um, UVB bulb inside this crappy fucking fixture. And um, that's going straight across, so I want them to get some time over there too. And this one doesn't fall down as much as it did on the tank downstairs, because the, the 75 gallon that I used downstairs, I got it from somebody and they they broke the uh, the uh, the, bra the brace. They snapped the brace in half, it just came off and that was terrible. So. Because of that, the tank couldn't just stay like tight enough to keep the cork stuck as well. But on this perfect, brand new tank that I got like last year, um, it stays up much better. So they have like some wet, some dry, and then that spot where the light is. So that's great. So I think this is good as long as they want to get up there. But you know, it's a new setup and it's got gravel. They didn't have gravel in the tank downstairs, so you know they're just checking things out really curious you know this poor guy uh, one of my filters uh, broke downstairs a couple days ago so it had I mean it had enough to keep the water clean but uh, that next day I noticed one eye and then the other eye so he can see just fine he's been eating just fine and his colors look great still but uh, you gotta be really careful with turtles, man. They're kind of dirty. So, but this isn't permanent. He got moved with them just because um, he was raising hell with my uh, Jack Dempsey's in the other tank, and you know they're pretty chill. I don't need like him stressing everybody out in this tank. Everybody's really relaxed and happy. So, you know, if maybe I can bulk up the uh, the male Jack and the female Jack. And they'll hold their little spot and he'll be alright because they don't try to bother him. They just try to ch stay like in a nice spot together. He'll have a bunch of the other tank to just hang out in. It's tank cleaning day. Don't mind. I gotta fill that up more. I did that one. I wanted that just at that level. I gotta do this one next. And I put on another filter from the tank that I had downstairs. One of the one of the uh, Aqua Clear 110s. And I keep the cover off just because... Well, actually, I got the cover for that one. I can throw that on there. But I keep the other one off because I put all, like, Pothos plants in it. That's a small one. But then I'm going to put another, the other 110 here. I just got to clean that, so right tomorrow. So this tank's going to be, like, fucking super clean like it used to. It's going to be even better because it's going to have gonna have two AquaClear 110s and an FX5 and I guess that 70 AquaClear which is alright I mean this. I gotta put some more plants in it